Hi everyone, my name is Christopher Walker and today we're going to be talking about how to create a new file in Jamboard. So there's actually two ways to get to Jamboard and create a new file. The first is using your URL and your URL bar you're going to type in jamboard.google.com and that's going to take you right to Jamboard and it's going to load up your files but you'll notice already in the bottom right hand corner we do have a plus button and from here you can click the plus button and it will create for you a new Jamboard and then you can get started. The other option is going to your drive by putting in drive.google.com or you can um, use the waffle if you see that in the top corner of anything that you're on. And then from here, um, you can actually create your new Jamboard in any of the folders that you've already created. So if I wanted to create one in this folder called Jamboard, I could click uh, into it. And then what I would do is I'm going to come up to the top left hand corner, click new, and then I'm going to scroll down until I get to the more option. And that's going to pop up in this new screen. And I'm going to scroll down even more until I see Google Jamboard. And again, what that's going to do is it's going to create a new file for me. And I'll even write um, for the title, I'll put example. And then uh, today is the May 18. So we'll put that in there and click OK. Now, if we go back to our drive and refresh it, we should see that new Jamboard is in the folder that I opened. And there it is right there. So that's a different way to create a new Jamboard file. I hope you enjoyed the short tutorial on how to create a new file for Jamboard.